Yes, we're back. We're back again in ETS 2. We're back again to carry on in Wick, where we left off last time, which means, of course, we're back again in Pro Mods. This time, however, we've changed truck. We've gone from the S500 down to the standard stock R360. Just to show that, yes, you don't need a lot of power uh, to pull trailers in ETS 2. And we're also, a slight change, we're sat on the right-hand side of the truck. Uh, we're not over there, we're over here. And we're going to try and take a job a job from Wick up to Iceland, if we can. Um, so grab that guidebook to Wick, and let's go. So hi there, Steve here, and welcome back to ETS2. Yeah, we'll jump in our trusty little Scania. Just to prove that you don't need a lot of power um, to get a job from here. So we'll look at the job market. We'll go to the freight market. We'll sort by route distance and see if we can get a job over to... That's a bit too far. Hmm, what about external contracts? Anything there? No. Right, we need to sleep then, aren't we? So let's go and do that. Just to see if we can pass the time and get ourselves a job out of here. We also want to make it morning if we can. So we'll skip it again. There we go. And now we check the job market. We'll try to freight market first, just to see if there is anything now over to there. Uh, from Wick. Again, too far. 337 miles. We didn't really want to go that far, actually. Uh, let's try external. Nothing. Despite the fact I've just slept. It's probably because of where we are. It's probably nothing. So what we might have to do then is we'll get across to, we'll take a load, we'll get across to that place, um, and then we'll end the journey without actually delivering it. And maybe then pick another load up the other side. So we'll get as far as the ferry port, um, and yeah, we'll see. We'll see how we go. We'll set that as a GPS destination anyway. Truck's not running. So let's go and pick our load up. If you're new to my videos, welcome. Um, yeah, ETS2, generally something that I stream on a Sunday, um, Sunday night, uh, stream over on Twitch. A group of us um, do some convoy trucking. Oh, I can't see that it's coming. Is it going to let me out? I think it's going to let me out. Didn't have to, really. And so yeah, don't do much in uh, single player or anything in single player at all. So it's a case of getting used to uh, driving in single player. Come on. You're going to stop there and let me out. Okay. And get used to the AI traffic. And at the moment, obviously, I'm sat on the wrong side of the truck from where I normally am. And slightly speeding. So, yeah, we'll take this load as far as um, Iceland. And then um, we'll grab another load when we get to Iceland. So I don't really want to travel too far, so we'll just do this as a, uh, a way of getting to Iceland. And then we'll see what happens after that. Now, as I record this, the uh, the video, uh, the first video, hasn't gone out yet. Um, so I don't even know, based on uh, views and feedback from that, as to whether you actually want to see this. So it could be that this that I'm recording, uh, you won't even see anyway. Which, if that's the case, why am I telling you? But if you're seeing it, it means you enjoyed the first one. 
and then I've done the second one. Right, I've got 31 miles to go to pick up our load. Definitely takes some getting used to driving on this side of the truck. Without speeding too much. Yeah, good to decide what truck to pick, and I do like an old Scania. So I thought, well, why not just go with the basic stock truck? Which, if I was starting again, which again is a series that I did uh, last year that didn't go down well, um, is you know starting again in the game. This is the truck I would choose, and would be more than happy with it for a while. Well, I'll build up some revenue. Nineteen miles to go, but doesn't pro miles look good? Looks so nice. I don't need fuel. First time I've used Pro Mod, as I said in the last video, for probably a couple of years now. It's just a real shame that it wasn't in multiplayer. A lot more driving to do. Uh, okay, right hand turn coming up. Right in front of him, yeah, we can. Plenty of room. So I guess a quarry then that we're collecting from up here. Well, I'm going a little bit quick. And load freight market yeah, it's that one there isn't it where's that one going ah we could change it we could take that couldn't we let's take that to there and then see if we can get one to go over there let's do that let's change our mind okay where is our load this way hopefully not somewhere ridiculous like up there yeah thanks for that you do realize I'm in a 360 don't you and now I've got to try and turn around just save that then yeah so take this to the halfway point and then see if we can get another job out from there that looks like a perfect screenshot moment let's just get that out of the way bit of that put that back okay We don't ground out coming down here. Oh. Yeah, that was a <clears throat> slight 
slight collision with the fence. Don't take offence. Okay, let's get going. It's definitely heavy. Can certainly feel that it's heavy. Which does mean you got to use the gearbox a bit more when you're in a 360. And you've got to be prepared to travel everywhere a little bit slower. I'm not in front of the police car really, do I? Graphically, this game looks absolutely superb. Yeah, as you can definitely tell going up there, look, that's slow. We've got me to eighth now really struggle does okay but around those bends and up that hill definitely a struggle so we've got to get to the port and then go across we'll dump this load and see if we can get us something to get us over into Iceland and then uh, that will do for this video slightly more careful not to speed. My left turn coming up then. A lot of police around here. more patient with it when you've got not a lot of power and quite a heavy load. Really think about when to change gears. I could have gone to ninth then. Would have kept the power going. But we'll get there. It's only a 50 limit. and slightly speeding I'm really looking forward to getting over to the roads in Iceland so hopefully these videos do go down well if you don't want to uh, see them on YouTube then I'll just carry on doing it myself anyway right approaching Thurzo at speed Right, 
very port turn right. Another old and very high out of the water. That's very high out of the water, uh, Euro Lines Ferry. Around here, and it says stop, so we will. And then we'll queue barge and make our way straight onto the ferry. Where there is no. How, how are all those cars going to fit on there? So we're going to Torshaven, which is where our load's going. Eventually, there we go. So now we drive on the other side of the road, don't forget. So the benefits of being in a right-hand drive have gone. And this is where our load's going. Just out of the ferry port. Should really be an eighth there. Oh, I got stuck on the fence now, I? Yeah, I have got stuck on the fence. Okay. So we'll back that up slightly. There we go. Um, and we'll go where do you need it. Let's be brave. And they want it round there. So if I go round the outside of the building. Fucking brakes on. Be while I'm not moving. We'll park this. Hopefully easily hopefully with an eye should be able to park that not first time obviously Oh, there we go. Somehow I accepted that. How do? 61 miles. We've got an excellent. Click continue. We'll jump back in. We'll come around here. And then see if we've got anything going out of here. Job market. Freight market. From here, back that way, plenty going the other way, that's not where we wanted to go really, nothing going over to, uh, let's look at external contracts, there better be nothing, no, okay what we can do then, is we can just hop foot it, so where's the other ferry go from? Um, it comes from here, doesn't it? it come from the same place? Um, yeah. 
So if I go back on the ferry. Oh no, it's the other one. Okay. If I just get on the ferry then, and we'll drive over to uh, drive over to Iceland without a load. And then when we get over there, we can have a look for something ready for the next time. And then next time we'll go um, the truck with a steering wheel on the other side. If there is a next time. If you want to see more, want to see me carry on this journey up through Iceland, uh, then please do let me know. Leave a comment below. And then I will, of course, uh, do more. I do really enjoy Euro Truck. I've tried it a few times on the channel and it's got really, really sort of not great responses because there's a lot of people out there doing Euro Truck videos and I understand that. Okay, let's get on this ferry then. Okay, and we're going to the unpronounceable place there. And already, yeah, it doesn't Iceland look great? Or do those who won't venture too far will come down here. And there's a hotel we can stop at. I don't think there's any actual pickup points here. I've just realised that I haven't actually got a garage. Yeah. So I need to look out how I can do that. We'll worry about that next time. Or is there a garage here? Let's have a look at the map. Is there a home garage here? There's one round here. I'll tell you what then. Let's um let's go around there. Fifty-two miles. And then we'll end there. Get to see a bit of uh, bit of the roads. And we'll end there, we can carry on from there if there is a next time. get to try some of this twisty stuff without having a trailer on board. Doesn't this look good? This we're having the winter mod on would be really good I suppose. If memory last time I drove in Iceland it got really slippery and really snowy at the north of the island. Call it an island I suppose it is. Sort of lost traction and everything. Yeah probably shouldn't be going this quick up here.
So maybe you stick with something underpowered slightly for the next leg. Just to make it more of a challenge around these roads and up these hills. But we'll go back to having something left hand drive. Maybe a different make as well. Rather than stick with a Scania. Although Scania is my favourite make in the game. But Iceland is stunning. Yeah, definitely going a bit quick. stopping there. Right, 23 miles to go. Okay, at least he's going right. Don't need fuel. Got plenty of that. Wow, this scenery. Doesn't that look good? Slightly off road in there. Okay, down into the town we come. And then we'll try and get a load from here next time. So there's a couple of places we can grab a load from. up here on the left. Okay, we'll buy that. up out the front here. There we go then, we made it to Iceland and yeah, what a great looking country this is going to be. We will carry on in this next time if you want to see more, uh, of course. Uh, if you do, leave a comment below going 
yeah your videos are awesome please do some more all words to that effect um and yeah and then we'll carry on here next time don't forget to check out my other content omsi videos firm bus videos bit of flight bit of train sim in there and if you like watching twitch don't forget i'm live on twitch every friday saturday and sunday nights friday night doing something a bit multiplayer saturday night doing a single player playthrough of something and then sunday night is trucking uh, multiplayer euro truck uh, where a few of us get together all driving the same truck taking the same load to the same place as everybody else does in mp um, but hopefully do it with a bit of fun and a bit of music as well so do please check that out twitch.tv forward slash steve chess underscore and don't forget that underscore that's it from me then until the next time if you have been thanks very very much for watching <laughs>